Welcome to Cook, Serve, Delicious 2 and my continuing attempts to do all the Chef for Hire events at all the restaurants and get a medal each time, preferably gold. This time around I'm going back to Budget Food Presents The World Tour and shift number 9 which has fried fish, pig's blood cakes, tablao or whatever that's called, pancakes and Salisbury steak with refried beans I think that is, cabbage or possibly sauerkraut and Brussels sprouts as the sides, pineapple juice as the drink, 60% buzz and 10 serving stations. So it's going to be busy during the rush hours and just after the rush hours, but hopefully I should be capable of doing this and getting a perfect day and a gold medal. Note the word hopefully there. Okay. That's my pig's blood cakes created. Couscous, tomatoes, cauliflower and parsley. That's that one created. One side started. Oh, it is sauerkraut. Not cabbage. Well, sauerkraut is cabbage. Okay. Got all the food I need prepared. All the sides either done or started. So far so good, I'm feeling quietly confident. Not sure why I'm feeling quietly confident, but I am. I think I'll do another side, just to make sure I've got plenty for when the rush hour starts, which is coming up. Apart from the warning alert I get in the top right for when a rush hour is coming up, when I get a dishwasher in the morning, I tend to think, okay, rush hour is just around the corner. Okay, I forgot what keys I was looking for there. And this is the bit I figured might get a bit, whoa! I was going to say a bit busy, but I didn't expect this many Salisbury steaks one after another. Ah, oh, I got to number 10. Okay, number 5 is done. what's just expired on me, but I'm a little too busy with the Salisbury steaks to look up and find out at this point. Oh, the, okay, pig's blood cakes and the tableau have both expired. Okay. Oh, let's do, clean the toilet. Do that lot. Three and four are done. Number five is pancakes. Now my fish has expired on me. Helps if I dunk that. And that was probably not a good time to start the dishwasher. Yes, yeah, so I'll get to you a lot in a second. Okay, I could probably do with some more sides right about now. As I hit the wrong key there by accident. Ah, uh, what's cooked? Number seven. Ok, 
Okay. Okay, feeling better about the next rush hour now. Which is quite good, considering it's just coming up. As is apparently every chore under the sun. Oh, and I'm about to run out of pig's blood thingies. Oh, well, that's that key combination. I forgot what keys to press then. Okay, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Another ten. Right, I'll do the chore, then I'll create some more fish. Oh, now that's run out. Okay. Parsley, onions, cucumber, and mint flakes. Ah, uh, number nine is done. Okay, I can do serve number ten and number eight, and number five for that matter. Great. Oh, is that the end of the rush hour? Okay. Uh, number seven wants to go next, apparently, followed by number six. Okay, I got a load of Salisbury steaks cooking. And because it likes to keep me occupied. A load of chores came in. I think that's my sides expiring more than anything. The noise I heard in my ear. Oh, okay. I think I just the day just ended. I was so busy getting into the rhythm of serving food that I didn't even look up to see as the day ended. Came as a little bit of a surprise to me, I must admit. But that was nice. 81 perfect combos. A perfect day completed. And my pretty shiny glorious gold medal. Oh, and I unlocked nothing new. A little bit of a disappointment. But that was the ninth shift at the World Tour, I believe. Yes. So next time I'm here, it's shift number 10. Slightly more challenging. But still within the realms of my skill level. Not that my skill level is ever particularly high at anything, but that one should be within the realms. Okay, two emails. Hair nets. Hey, super keen to visit your delectable place of business, but I gotta know, do you folks wear hair nets? The last place I went to didn't, and what I thought was the best icing sugar on the planet turned out to be really oddly sweet dandruff. Please let me know AS ASAP, I'm getting hungry. Sophie, extension 735. Oddly sweet dandruff, okay, that's a new one. Missed connections, Lakeside Lifeguard. The first thing I noticed about you was your brown eyes, which hovered right above mine as you administered CPR to my limp seaweed covered body. To you, I may just have been another girl who was too stupid to stay in the shallow end and too weak to swim in the deep. But to me, you're the one whose breath I still hold somewhere in my oxidated blood cells that would be blue if not for you. But now it is, I, but now it is, I, I that am blue. For it has been a year since the day, since that day, and I've never once seen you on duty again. Did you transfer to another lake or pool? Did saving my life inspire you to become a fireman? I am still drowning without you. Reply to this message and bring me back to life. Aw, oh, how sweet. I'm a sucker for a good, good romance tale. Yes, I'm strange. But I still do like a good romance tale. What's the term, um, chick flicks? If it's a good, what is termed a chick flick? If the acting's good, the story's good, and etc. I can quite happily enjoy a chick flick. I, I... I have an emotional softer side. I'm in, in touch with my softer side. At times. 90% of the time I 
have no empathy for practically anybody or anything. But every now and then, my softer side comes out and a nice romantic tale. Yeah, it can it can hit home. Okay, now I've confessed to my, one of my inner weaknesses. I will shut up. As always, I hope you enjoyed, and hopefully I will see you down the road for more Chef for Hire events in Cook, Serve, Delicious 2. Cheerio!